Hey guys, Luke264, and it's the day after the night before. It's currently 12.40pm, just after midday. My package has arrived, so I thought I might, I might as well show you. Uh, but before I do that, I'll just show you. There is the dead, broken PS3. Just a massive paperweight at the minute. So that's currently on eBay, uh, and yeah. So no, that's not right. That's a bit bad, right? <coughs> mm. So let's uh, have a look. Obviously, it's not important. Not well. It is quite important to me, I suppose, because honestly. In my opinion, <coughs> after using quite a few different methods since the PS3 broke, I have to say that in my opinion, the PS3 is the best media player thing that there is at the moment. Obviously I haven't tried everyone in the world, because that would be very difficult. I'm not rich, uh, but having tried things like, obviously I've tried the, my Xbox before, the reason I don't like my Xbox is when you're playing something off a portable device, say USB memory stick or an external hard drive as I frequently do, um, when you play stuff off an external hard drive like that you have to select it each time, so say you're watching a series or a season or something. Alright, good example, me and my uh, fiance this weekend wanted to watch Man vs Food. So I've got all the Man vs Food, they're on my hard drive. Got to season, uh, I think we're up to halfway in season 3 or something like that. But every time you want to watch an episode, you play it, it plays, when it, when, when it finishes, goes back to the Xbox menu, not the full thing, you've still got the thing, the episode list there. But you've got to choose, you've got to press a physical button every time you want to play the next episode. For the PS3, if it's all in the same folder, once one's finished, it'll auto-play the next. Auto-play is a massive thing for me because I'm quite lazy. The other one that I've tried since the... Um, PS3's been out of commission is Windows Media Center streaming it from my laptop to my Xbox that I have to say is the second best that works extremely well uh, given that your laptop desktop whatever you use to stream is plugged in via Ethernet cable to the router or whatever you have <coughs> wirelessly streaming I can't say it's very good, to be quite honest with you, with nobody else in the house using any form of Wi-Fi internet devices, just the laptop on, no, no good. Um, I've also tried like external, you can buy like little boxes, um, you know, that you can just plug in straight to your telly. No gaming device or all like that, just little devices that you can plug in. They work okay, but no. I'll pull this off a bit long. Like I say, you, you, there's, there's not, not special about it, it's only a PS3, I just thought I'd show it on camera. Uh, So there we go, 160 gig. Just got the cheapest one that I could find because I don't really store things on the hard drive. Um, <coughs> like I say, that's that over there's a 60 gig model, uh, launch model. That really, 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 really didn't want to 
have to get a slim or a new Xbox, uh, new PS3 because I did plan on doing PS1 and PS2 games as future LPs, very very future LPs, but I did plan on that. So I think the only way that I'm going to be able to do that, unless I can download them from the PSN network, is emulators or buy a cheap PS1 or PS2, but then it definitely won't be in HD because this obviously does upscale, well that does upscale PS1 and PS2 games maybe not PS1 games, definitely PS2 games um, but yeah so chuck and black and all that what there you go the killer fact important PlayStation 2 format software uh, titles do not I can't. I can't read it backwards. Perform on this system. Yeah. Um, might as well open it up. Oh. oh. It's frigging. Yeah. I did also. Uh, because this was the cheapest one that I could find. Um, let me show you. Did actually. Come in Battlefield 3 as well for the PS3. Uh, that's still sealed. I'm not going to bother playing that. I'm going to sell that uh, as is. Because, like I said, I don't play on the PS3 gaming, really. Um, the only reason I bought that PS3 was <coughs> to wait for Metal Gear Solid 4. But yeah, um, I'm going to sell that and then I'm going to get a new game that's coming out. Well, it's a new game. A bundle that's coming out on Friday. It's currently Tuesday, the 31st. So that comes out on Friday the 3rd. So hopefully I'll get enough for that to get the bundle. So we've got DualShock 3, 6 axis controller. feels a lot better than the uh, one that I bought when they first came out. I actually imported one from uh, Japan before they actually came out over here. And because I did import it, didn't really use it all that much. Sold it on eBay again before they were still out over here. I got quite a bit of money back, I must say. So, do that, does that plug straight into the back now or...? USB cable, I don't need that. Don't need the audio video cable because I do have a component cable which I bought before Christmas. <coughs> Knowing that I'd have my HCPVR. And then obviously I couldn't use it. It's wonderful, isn't it? Right. Ooh. What else in there? Actually, seen, seen a slim up close. Okay. Well, I'll go set this up, guys, and thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Take care.